So guys, Michael Chandler recently revealed that he would be pulling out of fighting Conor McGregor at the end of the year. He went on to say, never mind guys, I think it's time I finally admit the fight is off. He's still in stage 2 of 7 of grief pertaining to his career being over. Figured he'd be close to 5 by now. Godspeed at the Notorious MMA. Conor McGregor responded back, lol, okay little bro. Swapped out handy. At Blessed MMA, where you at December? The real BMF you know. Michael Chandler ended it off with Max wouldn't even fight me, let alone you. Don't act like you hold the cards. Swan Song incoming. Paddy Pimlet recently reflected on his fight with Bobby Green. On his Instagram he went on to say not a single mark on my face, but apparently I was getting dog walked. UFC lightweight Matt Frivola commented they hate you cause they ain't you. Good win lad, and congrats on the ranking, but more importantly becoming a dad. I'm gonna handle business in Paris, and then I'm coming to test that chin. Dana White recently gave his thoughts on Mike Perry's TKO loss to Jake Paul. Speaking to TNT Sports, he went on to say I haven't even talked to Perry in a long time and I don't even know Jake Paul was fighting. I was on vacation in Italy. I had no idea. There's all these stories that were written. It's ridiculous. I stopped paying attention to Jake Paul when he lost to Fury. You know what I mean? It's like when he fought somebody that was his age and actually boxed. He lost and I'm not on the kid. I don't even think about him anymore. It doesn't even cross my mind. I have no beef with him. They're trying to get me assassinated. Nobody's trying to get you assassinated, especially, listen. I respect Perry. Smaller, older. I mean, it's the same blueprint they're fighting older, smaller guys. That's just, I literally don't think about him anymore. It's all 